Hey guys, Robin here from Robin TCP with another video. I haven't posted in a while, sorry. But here, I am with a new video with an up unboxing video. And it is the Bludgeon Brothers, Luke Harper and Eric Rowan. These figures, I just bought them like a month ago. No, like two weeks ago. I ordered them, but they just came today. So... I'm ready to unbox it. Oh, sorry. And, okay. I have these two figures. I bought them in Ringside Collectibles. And I recommend that. If you guys want to buy it, try it out. Okay. And, yeah. Let's get into the review. First, we have Eric, I need Luke Harper. I like her more but okay. So first we have the figure comes with his jacket with his I don't know if you can see it or not. Probably you probably can't. Like his hammer or something and his extra hand. On the side here we have his picture. And on the back we have another picture, some information, if you want to pause it, you can just read it and pause the video. Yeah. And here, let me read this word. The darkness of destruction always prevails over the fertility of light. Where the bludgeon brothers go, annihilation follows. And these are the other people coming with Elite Series 65, 66, which includes Nikki Cross, Kurt Angle, AJ Styles, Kevin Owens, and the Bludgeon Brothers, which I have. And this side, we have Harper, even though I think they should have put Luke Harper, but they just put Harper for some reason. And that is for this box. Let's go over to Eric Rowan's one. He made his debut, like, I mean, not his debut, his return a week ago at Royal Rumble. He helped, he helped then right now. I hope they keep this team still, the Bludgeon Brothers, because I really like them. I just got the figures. I don't want them to form another team. Okay, so I'm gonna discuss it. Here, we have Eric Rowan with his mask over there, his hood which comes off, his jacket, his belt which again comes off, his hammer or mallet, whatever you want to call it, and his hat. And this one has inter interchangeable hands, like I said, and it's at least 66, right? like Luke Harper. And again, they didn't put Eric Rowan, they put Rowan, for some reason. I don't like it, but it's fine. Plus eight. Pretty good. And then this side. Oh, sorry. This side, we have his picture. Pretty good picture. On the back, we have some information about him. Like his weight and height and finisher. And those kind of things. And where he's from. You can read that. And it has the same description over here. The same people as Luke Harper. And that's it. And Oh, I forgot to read this. Career Highlights, SmackDown Tag Team Champions, and NXT Tag Team Champions. I didn't know that. But, okay, I found out about it. So guys, I'm going to review them both right now, today, in this video. I'm going to be back when I open. Okay guys, I'm back. And... Here are the figures. I love them. They look way better up close than what they did in the package. So let me get you guys a little closer and let's review them. Okay, let me put the little carpet pack. We're gonna start with Eric Crow. Here, we have the figure with all the coat and everything on. The mask goes in there by this ear. This sheep ear goes through the hood. 
Uh, you can't put it on there if you don't do that. And it's not attached to the hood, so that's not really good, but it's fine. And then here's the mallet. Looks sick, tons of designs. This side of it. And a pretty good. The jacket comes off really easily, and it's really good jacket. And okay, I'm gonna take these off and show you guys a little close. I'm gonna take it off the front here so you guys can see it better. This, these two come off that easily. And this jacket comes off pretty easily. Let me first take it. Actually, now that I said it, it comes off a little harder than I thought, but it still comes out pretty good. And then, it's still not finished. It has this belt, which you can still take off by doing this. And the belt is off. I don't know why you want to do that, because it, be, it never happened, but it's good. I'm just going to keep it on for now. And let's go over the figure now. We did the accessories, now the figure itself. Okay. Here, we have great black pants with red details. The body, the belt has a great Bludgeon Brothers, Br Bludgeon, Bludgeon Brothers logo. I can't even say the name. And some... It, it's pretty good. It's black. That's pretty much it. The body has a red color with a black strap coming, and on these parts, it's pretty good with those silver dots. And he has some wristbands, wrist tapes, more like yeah. And that's pretty much it from Eric Rowan. Pretty great figure. Let me put his belt on. And oh, I almost forgot. He has two interchangeable hands. So you can just take the hands off. Like, you just push it hard and it comes off. And the first time it's a little hard. It took me a second, but you can take it out. Put the hand down, put the new hand in, and to push a little, and it goes in, like an actual hand. Wait, let me put it in. Sorry guys, you have to wait a second, I'm trying to put this hand in. The first time it's hard, but as you do it more and more, it will get easier. Yep, there we go. Look, I changed the hand from the open hand to the fist. That is Eric Rowan. Let's go. Let's take all of these aside. Let's go to Luke Harper. He has the same hand, so I'm not going to show you guys the hands. It's the same thing. Two fists. And here's the figure. It has the same mallet, exact same one. No difference. So take the, let's take that off. <coughs> Sorry guys. And he has this great jacket. The hood doesn't come off like the other one. But it's still pretty good. It has one sleeve here, but this hand doesn't. This hand has wrist tape, that one has just wrist bands. And let me take off the jacket for you guys to see it better. This one's a little harder because of the sleeve. It still comes off very very easily. And it came off. Look how tall that is. Okay, here we have Luke Harper with this black beard. The face scan is awesome. The hair looks awesome. The shoes are black awesome. The pants are black with red detailing, like the, the Eric Rowan one. Awesome. The shirt has is red, sleeveless, with these black lines. Awesome. One had a huge wrist, wrist tape, and the other one little wristband. And that's pretty much it. 
from these two figures. These two figures are one of my favorites of all time. They are just beautiful. Let me put this up like this. Okay. They are really good. And I recommend buying them. If you can't afford it, I'm pretty sure. It, I don't know. I think there will be basics coming out. Or they already did. I don't know. But these are awesome. And I bought them. Both of them for $50. Okay, guys, I think that's it. And, oh, I forgot to say something about the future of this channel. I am going to make WWE 2K19 my universe, universe mode. Yes, guys, that is true. I'm going to be recording them on Saturday and Sundays, edit them on Mondays, and put it out on Tuesdays so watch out for that one it's gonna come next week the first episode the draft actually no I don't know you guys have to see it but that's it guys hope you enjoyed this video and that's it make sure to like subscribe comment down below what you want to see next put in push the notification button so you'll be notified and see you guys next time bye